I think the anti-Semitism situation in our country is not because of Kanye West. It's just this image of what they believe it stands for, which is oppression. Anti-Semitic banners were hung over the 405 freeway this past weekend in reference to a controversial tweet by Kanye West. Kanye's a blip on the screen, in my opinion, for where we are right now, because all the people who live in the towns out in the center of our country who have never met a Jew are what are creating the narrative right now that is so scary, because most prejudice, in my opinion, comes from that fact that they've never met the person that they are afraid of. The Anti-Defamation League of LA and the Jewish Federation of Greater LA have chosen not to name this particular group to the public. This isn't their first act of hate speech, but the banners seen on Saturday were a little different. The signs read, Honk if you know, and Kanye is right about the Jews. Hope is what they've lost. And um, they're looking for someone to tell them something you know, unfortunately, this does not sound too far off from a lot of what happened in Nazi Germany. Twitter and Instagram have disabled his accounts. Companies such as Vogue, Balenciaga, and his talent agencies have stopped endorsing the rapper, and many political representatives of California have sided against him. For Canyons News, I'm Stuart Carpell.